The new X Studio app in the 3D render role is your gateway to producing grade A marketing content on the cloud. When you open the 3D X Site 3D Render dashboard, make sure to examine the tips for getting started tab. You'll find instructions for using the app along with some helpful resources to download. X Studio is based on the Stellar rendering engine, the same technology that powers 3D X Site. The app is simple and intuitive with drag and drop workflows and easily understood feedback on commands. 3DXML is the file format for products in XStudio. These can be created with SolidWorks Connector, SolidWorks Connected, or any of the X apps on the platform. I'll use this partial grilling station as an example that was uploaded to the platform with SolidWorks Connected. Perhaps the most important aspect of good renders is the materials. XStudio comes with materials that you can download from the Getting Started tab and later bring into the experience. Cover materials can be applied in other apps like XDesign or here in XStudio. Simply double click the part you want to change and drag the material anywhere in the viewport. To take things a step further, add scenes to help your end client visualize the product in its real world location. These can also be downloaded from the Getting Started tab. The grill would look great on a patio, so I'll apply the indoor environment that contains indoor and outdoor views. Currently, the view is locked on a still image. That's because each environment comes with a backplate that can be enabled or disabled. Now that it's toggled off, the scene can be rotated to a better position within this 360 degree environment. Other settings can be adjusted as well, such as how close to the ground the model is if backplate is enabled, the reflectivity of the surrounding environment, the glossiness, and the amount of lighting exposure. When you're nearly ready to produce a final image, use the live preview window that provides an instant, dynamic preview of the final render. That looks pretty good. Now it's time to start the render that will be exported. A render preview in this dialog box allows you to confirm the image you'll be getting. Here we see that the camera scene has not been updated, so I'll simply return to the viewport and click Apply Camera View to Scene. Resolution and quality can be adjusted to match the desired level of refinement. Credits are consumed according to these parameters, and these are available for purchase with the 3D Excite 3D Render Roll. With the new XStudio app on the 3D Experience platform, cloud rendering is just a few clicks away.